Kia ora guys, what's up? I'm Brooke, I'm from MyFM and today we're at Kelly Talton's in Tamaki Makoto, Auckland with Corey Webster to uh, to really just to get to know you a little bit better. You ready? I'm ready. Let's buddy. get Let's it. Do it. Alright, we're about to um, swim with sharks. <laughs> Are you scared? You alright? I'm alright, bro. When was the last time you put on one of, one well, of these? bro. I'm training yesterday. Nah, <laughs> uh, not. Probably not since I was a kid. 10, maybe 10 years old. <laughs> when was the last time you legit went for a swim? In the ocean? Yeah. Last summer, obviously. Yeah, sure. Yeah. You nice swim in the ocean, bro. Go for the North Shore. Yeah, you're alright. Okay, let's just <laughs> swim some sharks, eh? <laughs> Good bro. Uh, surprisingly fun. It was, you know, it was more fun than scary. What would you think about the sharks and the stingers? They were bigger than I thought they were. Yeah. I found out that um, the the lady in there she was lovely, but she uh, she was telling us that they only they can eat like once every month. What? Yeah. So they, they get in there, they feed them once every wow. two, uh, twice a week. Sorry, but they can go up to a month without eating. So. Wow. Yeah, that was that was very very cool. This one's having a meeting. Yeah. <laughs> what's um what's one thing that that no one would know about Corey Webster? One thing that no one knows. Wow, my great grandfather, eight generations yeah. away, I think, is uh, the Maori king Tafio. So you're a real Tihei Maori owner. To be honest, I want to I want to I want to learn more about it. I haven't done any research or much. I don't know. think anyone would have known that though. Nah, bro. No, no many people know that. Uh, how, how has dad life changed you up? Bro, I'm loving it, bro. It's, yep. I think everything changes when you have kids. It's not about you anymore. It's right. just about them, you know? Everything you do is it's about them. I got two little boys to provide for and right. put food on the table and put a roof over their heads. So you just so, want to make them have a good life and make sure they're looked after and cared for. So, you know, that's the main thing. But it's awesome, bro. It changes you as a person and just yeah. makes you less selfish. Like, who's the greatest rapper the of all time? Nas. Rappers only. Nas. Nas. Yeah. Yeah. He's my goat. Look at the camera. I don't want to nip my face. What do I think? That was cool. Cool experience. Who's the greatest shooter New Zealand's ever produced? Me. Can we go uh, top fun? three? Like, top this, three, this okay. This my top three, and yep. I'd have you in there. Yep. I'd have Kirk in there, and I'd have Phil Jones. Same. Those guys are great shooters. I learned, I learned most of what I know from Kirk, coming yeah. up under Kirk. You know, I'll go up against anyone in the world, I feel. Yeah. With shooting, just standing there shooting, yeah. anyone but. That's my top three as well. Who yeah. can you not stand? Like, in who's the league? The one person in the league that you cannot stand and you just want to give them 35? <laughs> to be honest, when it's game time, bro, they're all enemies. Yeah. It's like, they're all equal once we step on the lines. Um, there's guys that you like, like when I go up against Chris Goulding though. Uh, that's the one, Because bro. he's, another, he's another, another scorer, bro, who's a high, you know, a high rated player. So when you go up against guys like that, it's kind of a, Aside from the game, it's a one-on-one -on -one yeah, battle yeah. as well. But it's not a hate thing, it's like a, I respect his game, yeah, so, yeah. but I still want to when we're on the court, yeah, yeah, give it to them, so. You know, new season coming up, what do you think it takes this year? Well, I think this year's probably our best chance in the, in the last few years right. to, to fight for that championship, um, bringing Ty in, and then just because we've all played together for so long, you know, we've got a lot of the Tall Blacks there, and then uh, our coaches have done a great job with recruiting. So I think the, the team that we've put together this year is the best team in a while. We've kind of fell short the last couple of years, injuries and you know all types of stuff happening. So I yeah. think this year's our year, bro. Mm. It's looking good. I know everyone's very excited. Good luck for the season, my brother. Appreciate you, bro. Bring it home. We will. <laughs> 